my new toy has arrived. Oh my god, so excited. Can't wait to make soap. Um, I'll go to show you a quick example of how I bevel my soaps with this now that I've got it. Got a new plane and beveler and soap cutting machine. So I thought I'd show you how I'm using it. There we go flatly along the sides to get a nice because this bar of soap came up quite rough edged because I'm bad at cutting so we go across that and I think you have to run it a couple of times because of how unlevel my cutting was these are just a few things that I can do while I'm sitting in bed because I'm not able to stand at the moment comes up lovely look at that don't know if you can pick it up on the camera it's so smooth I think I've still got a little nobule nodule nobule other side obviously once I'm cutting these properly with this cutting machine I won't have to blame quite so much off to make them nice and neat and you can do the sides I do god Mama. that was clever wasn't it <laughs> Just typically, this bit yeah. that's to cut the soap with. How what? do you cut the soap with that? It's a cat gut wire, like um, guitar wire type thing. What do you mean? I don't think it works very well, but I've got I've oh, got some cheese cutting wire. I see that. Um, that I'm going to try and do put on it. I think rather than having that wire, because that wire won't cut through soap very well. I see what you mean. Yeah. Do you have one like that? Um, I have a cheese slicer, don't I? But I don't have one like this. This one's got grooves in it, so as you can get exactly the right, no, right I mean straight like lines. The, um, wire. <laughs> edges I think that could do with a little one more right all nice straight edges and now we're going to go in and, and bevel these corners so we go into the groove for, for a nice bevel you want to go twice other side
I'm not sure if one's slightly different, so I'm just do, using the one um, just in case they're slightly different grooves. I think they are. This one's a bigger groove. That one's a smaller groove. Yeah, that feels like it. Yeah, so I want to make sure they're all even on the same bars. At the end, do you want to do like a cross section? Yeah, I'll do Every side done, planed, beveled. Okay, just the stone one, the moon, and then that's a smooth, and then this is the hand cut one by mummy. And underneath, how exciting! We have soap curls, yay! Ooh, aren't they cute? They're going to be great, they are. I'm going to put them in another soap. That'll look good. I'm so excited to get this. I bought this for £10 from Hong Kong. I was really expecting it to take ages. And it came very quickly. I'm very happy with it. I'm so excited that I need to make soap so I can cut my first bar of soap with it. Look how smooth it is. Looks great compared to the other one, doesn't it? Really does, like shiny and everything. Focusing. There. Focus on the focus thing. You can see how smooth it is. I'm an expert at focusing. <laughs> my film, my my director today is Gracie. There's some bubble like not, that has not been popped, so that's okay. It? Yeah, it's it because of where we've just cut into it. But that was that happened quite. Because this them one. this was the dancing funnel swell, so it was quite hard not you to get bubbles. That, but you did that like on um, the sky. Mhm. Mm yeah, they're quite old bars, like they've been, um, they're completely uh, cured now, so you can stop filming now. Thank you, guys. Bye. Bye.